There is no secret that Cardano has experienced some dips in the last quarter of 2021. So what is the truth behind the claim that Robert Kiyosaki said Cardano will be worthless? This and more in this video, so make sure to stay tuned until the end. According to Robert Kiyosaki, author of Rich Dad Poor Dad, the United States has entered a period of depression. According to him, we are on the verge of a major crash followed by a new depression. So you should be aware of the fact that you possess an ADA card and make sure to stay until the end to learn more about it. Robert Kiyosaki, one of the world's most respected authors and investors, warned that a new downturn would happen in the United States in the wake of a sharp crash. An overview of Kiyosaki is that he co-authored Rich Dad Poor Dad with Sharon Lecter in 1997. This New York Times bestseller list has been on for nearly six years. Further, more than 109 countries have purchased the book, which has been translated into 51 languages. Recently, the famous author tweeted that the United States is suffering from melancholy. In addition to this, Kiyosaki said that President Joe Biden and the Federal Reserve were robbing the people and that inflation is needed to prevent a new depression. Inflation tears off the poor. Further, it is said that Biden and the Fed are both corrupt because inflation increases the wealth of the wealthy. As he continued, he stated that one must prepare for the following, a massive crash followed by another depression. He also advised that we should invest wisely in gold, silver, and Bitcoin. Also, several people are anxious about inflation. According to Senator Rick Scott on Fox News Sunday, Americans are entitled to be outraged when it comes to how Democrats handled their money. Furthermore, President Joe Biden's Build It Back Better program will only exacerbate the country's ridiculous inflation rate. Additionally, regardless of what they call it, what they're talking about is going to produce more inflation. Further, the stock market meltdown has been predicted by Kiyosaki before gold, silver, and Bitcoin may fall as well, he said back then. And after the crash, that cash should be perfect for picking up bargains. Also, in the well-known author's statement, he made it clear that he is not selling gold, silver, or Bitcoin. Are we to take this as a sign that Cardano will crash as well? For me, the answer is no. Meanwhile, we have some good news on Cardano that will help you reestablish your faith in the currency. With a big update and more upgrades to Cardano, it appears they are scaling big this year, which will only lead to more great things. Meanwhile, we also need to recall with some technical analysis that the whole crypto market is slowing down significantly recently. Apparently, the bull run was short-lived based on four consecutive days of high sell pressure, but we should keep in mind that similar conditions are present in both the crypto and securities markets. And by analyzing the MACD, we can conclude the volatility has once again moved into oversold territory. Adding to that, some major catalysts are coming up that could cause certain people to be very excited. So the next point is to talk about Cardano's scalability, which could be one of the reasons why Cardano is here to stay. Cardano's chain has a transaction rate of two transactions per second. Despite all the big talks from the ADA Moon Boys about 250 TPS not being optimized yet from scratch, the truth is that ADA does not support more than two TPS. Some people believe Sunday Swap is the issue, while others say it's not that bad since you do not have to pay excessive fees. However, the reality is that ADA will end the day with less than 2 TPS and 100% full blocks. Due to Cardano's inability to handle more than 2 transactions per second under live conditions with smart contracts, blocks are full. There is no doubt that ADA is as congested as Ethereum, but it only does one-tenth of the transactions, making it 10 times slower than Ethereum and hundreds or thousands of times slower than every other L1S. Furthermore, Cardano announces the launch of the Sunday Swap, a major process to boost the scalability of Plutus. In addition to this, Plutus's scalability will be increased by boosting the scalability of IOG, the company behind Cardano. And as Sunday Swap Dex finally launches on the mainnet, this is Cardano's smart contracts platform. As part of its tweets on the 20th of January 2021, IOG stated that the process is designed to increase the Plutus script memory by 1.2 million on the Cardano mainnet. In the report, it was mentioned that the increment will take effect on the 25th of January. Consequently, the major process will result in an increase in script memory units per transaction on the smart contracts platform. And according to an announcement shared on the Input Output Global Twitter account this morning, they're in the process of introducing an updated proposal that would allow a 1.25 million increase in the Pluto script memory units per transaction on the Cardano main network. Beginning on Monday, the 25th of January, the initial change will take place at the boundary of Epic 317. After this change, the Pluto script will have 12.5 million memory 
customer units per transaction instead of the current 11.25 million. Additionally, the continued scaling of Cardano for future growth will allow us to make incremental adjustments and network optimizations in the coming weeks. Furthermore, IOG expects a major upgrade to increase Plutus resources and those of decentralized application developers and DAP developers. If the upgrade is not deployed within five days, it will be monitored for at least five days to determine the next increment. The Sunday Swap is now in beta. This is because Sunday Swap was announced in a blog post on the 15th of January as a fully functional beta decentralized exchange, as well as yield farming Sunday Rewards, which has just started. Furthermore, creating pools and deposit liquidity is now available on Sunday Swap Labs, and swapping is coming soon as well. According to the earlier mentioned announcement, Cardano holders should expect a network congestion with the arrival of many exciting projects. Moreover, there is no doubt that Cardano NFT projects are already flourishing on the platform. In the coming weeks, DeFi will announce several exciting new projects, which will cause some network congestion, especially around launches and airdrops. Also, transactions may take longer to go through due to the network being designed to safely handle peak loads. However, throughput will steadily improve as we continue optimizing the network. Cardano remains a buy as there are major factors at play which make it a great opportunity to get ADA at a discount, especially as the market continues to move downwards. As a result of the number of catalysts coming up, I have always been more optimistic about the Cardano ecosystem's future. According to CoinMarketCap, there were about 33.5 billion ADA in circulation this January 2022. Although this figure changes from time to time. Moreover, the global supply is limited to 45 billion ADA. Due to the fixed supply, Cardano is similar to Bitcoin, where the supply is limited to 21 million coins, as opposed to Ethereum, which has an unlimited supply, but a limited annual distribution. In Cardano, the proof-of-stake system allows those who own the cryptocurrency, those who are interested in maintaining the system's integrity, to validate transactions on the blockchain. And as part of the system's operation, they earn crypto coins as rewards. In the case of incorrect correct transactions, stakes may lose money if validators approve them. In addition, as a cryptocurrency owner, you can stake your coins with a validator and receive a proportional reward, though frequently with a fee. Do you think Cardano is a good investment? As with many cryptocurrencies, Cardano has experienced volatility in its price. Cardano may be down from its recent highs, as are many other crypto coins. But many who have held on to it have probably made significant profits, especially if they bought it and held it since its debut. It's more important to understand exactly what you're buying, rather than looking at recent gains or losses. In addition, Cardano will gain interoperability with other blockchains and other significant upgrade. By the time Basho is fully deployed, Cardano is capable of interacting with other blockchains and moving assets, NFTs, smart contracts, and more from one network to another. In most blockchains, deals between networks need to be moved using clunky bridge patches, and this is Cardano's advantage. Additionally, there are several Basho upgrades that will encourage Cardano transactions to become faster, cheaper, and more secure. And once again, it's Cardano's advantage. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. Look in the comments section for what to do. Make sure you click the subscribe and bell buttons.